Good morning from downtown Seattle, everybody. We are going to start the day off today with a Hitmonchan raid. We've actually got two of them, but I'll probably only check one with you right now, unless the other one ends up shiny. But we're currently waiting in line for breakfast. Well, MJ's waiting in line for breakfast, so I didn't have to like film everybody sitting outside trying to enjoy their breakfast. We've got a big plan today. We've got the Seattle Space Needle. We're gonna do Chihuly Garden in glass, and I'm not sure what else we're gonna do because that's probably gonna take most of the day. And then tomorrow is our last day here, which we're going to do uh, the Mopop Museum for that. But right now I just figured, you know, we're waiting in line, we're gonna get some breakfast, and I wanna see if we can get a shiny Hitmonchan. All the tasks around here suck right now, but that's okay. We'll find some new ones when we move on down to the Space Needle. But down goes the first Hitmonchan. Let's take a look at this, and then I'm gonna hop back in line, get some breakfast, and head out for the day. So this is gonna be 1288. But will it be shiny? Go to bonus. No, that's all we want is the one shiny. But we're gonna go ahead, catch this, get some breakfast, and head over to the Space Needle. Okay, y'all, I'm gonna make this really quick because I'm not trying to disturb anybody and it's so quiet in here. But we made it to the Chihuly Garden and Glass exhibit. Uh, wifey tried to kill me on the way here from breakfast because she wanted to do the lime scooters and those things are insane. They're so fast, but they're fun. Um, there's so much Pokemon here. There's so many tasks. There's a lot of raids. Nothing has hatched yet. So what we're gonna do is explore through here. We've got like four hours here and then we're gonna head over to the Space Needle. We've got a lot to do, but enjoy all of the art and all of this stuff and we'll see you when we have something Pokemon related. Okay guys, so that was the inside of the exhibit and currently we're sitting in the glass house which was like the biggest dream of Chihuly to have done and part of the inspiration for it was the Saint Chapelle in France which we have actually been to. I have stood inside the Saint Chapelle and seeing this compared to being there and the inspiration between the two is honestly quite amazing. It's quite beautiful but if you look behind us here we're actually going to be going outside in a minute but before we do while it's quiet in here i'm going to show you guys the pokemon around here so look at this this is uh what is the park name i don't know, I don't know the park's name here but this is where the space needle is the gardening glass is uh the mopop museum all that stuff and currently on the nearby there are 12 raids none of which i care to do but we've got a couple of three stars which could be Hitmonchan or Hitmonlee, which I'm doing both because I would take a good shiny Hitmonlee, why not? But we've got seven and a half hours of incense currently running. No shinies yet this morning, no hundos yet this morning. But honestly, like I've just been running the gotcha because I don't care. I'm, I'm enjoying all of this and I hope you guys are too. So we're gonna go ahead and wander around outside. We also need to get uh, MJ a coffee because I had two lattes at breakfast and she just had a mimosa so instead of waking up she's trying to go back to sleep but we're gonna go through the gardens we've got like another two and a half hours here and then we're gonna head over to the Space Needle we're doing the night and day so that's gonna be a lot of fun too and I think in between we'll get some lunch we'll do some Pokemon but for now let's head outside
right, y'all, so we officially made it through the Chihuly glass exhibit, and that was absolutely amazing. And right now we're gonna do a little Hitmonchan raid before we go find some lunch, because I don't really know where we're gonna go get lunch right now. We thought there was a cafe over here, but we can't really find it. So I'm gonna have her pull up Google and look around for restaurants. But yeah, that was the Chihuly Garden and Glass exhibit. Um, I gotta say, it, it blows my mind that I'm able to make art of my own following someone else's art around the world and things like that. It's just, it's been a really fun, fun time here. And I mean, I literally have the space needle behind me right now and Hitmonchan goes down. So let's see if we can get ourselves a shiny over here with the space needle and go. No, it's never gonna be shiny. All right, let me catch this and I'll show you guys what we're dealing with in the park right now until it's time to go into the space needle. And Hitmonchan, horrible, not a surprise. So outside of everything, like these tasks suck, I'm not gonna lie, we tried to find a bunch of them, but we've got raids everywhere, nothing good on the nearby right now. We did do a Hitmonchan raid, we did a Timber raid, we did a couple of Shinx raids, and nothing. I'm just not having the luck right now. We're also trying to get enough candy to evolve Skrelp and Clauncher. So I'm gonna keep the incense running, I'm gonna keep looking at raids and stuff, and hopefully, we can come back with something sparkly or something good to evolve. I don't know, but we're gonna go get some lunch and then head up the Space Needle. Okay, so the issue we're having right now is there's no food open anywhere, but behind us, you can see this uh, purple building. That's Mopop, that's where we'll be tomorrow. But yeah, we, uh, we looked at like 10 restaurants, two cafes and a beer garden and nobody's open. So we've got, oh, an hour and a half before we go to the top of the Space Needle where they have a cafe, but I'm pretty sure you don't get access to that until you go up there. So I guess for now, we're just gonna wander around and hopefully find something. There's nothing on the nearby for raids or anything entertaining right now. I can't find any tasks to check either. So for now, we're just gonna wander around, explore this, and I guess hopefully find some food. All right, guys, so we're gonna hop in on a Shinx raid for content purposes because I haven't done like anything Pokemon Go related today. And there's no Hitmon Lees, there's no Hitmon Chans. We did just have a quick lunch, uh, just like snacks and stuff, over at the oldest bar in Seattle. So that was really cool. But we're headed back to the Space Needle because in 18 minutes, our time slot to go to the top will be ready. I am so sorry if my camera is out of focus. It cannot focus with this stupid mask on. Shinx, not shiny, clicked all the way through, wasn't even paying attention. So I'm gonna go ahead and catch this. I cannot find anything in the city for tasks for like catch fighting types or anything. It's just, it's garbage today. I don't know what's going on. But we're gonna go up to the Space Needle. We're gonna catch some Pokemon up there. There's raids popping soon, hopefully something good and we'll see you in a few. Wait, before we cross, before we get over to where all the copyrighted music is playing, I have one five kilometer egg. It could be something good. I was gonna click on it. it, was, it the screen it. recording did it. Yeah, it's a Makuhita, what a bunch of crap. Well, y'all, we have officially made it to the top of the city. We are on the very top of the Space Needle. It's terrifying, to be completely honest. It's fine. She's fine. It's fine. It's completely terrifying to be, to be honest. I'm not gonna lie, but I'm still enjoying it. The sights are gorgeous. And if we look here, we've still got oodles of Pokemon. Ooh, shiny female Nidoran? No, that would have been great. But I'm going to do this Shinx raid in a minute. And that's what we're gonna go ahead and catch while we're up here and see if we can get that as shiny because there's really been nothing. I can't get the tasks, I can't get anything. So I'm gonna walk around. We're probably gonna go ahead and just stay here until sunset at this point, which isn't for like four hours, but you have to come in at like six for the last entry. So we're probably just gonna stay and hang out, maybe get some snacks, a little wine, something here, we'll figure it out. But I'm gonna go do this raid in a few minutes, but before we do that, we're gonna enjoy some more sights here and then head down to the revolving floor. <laughs> 
All right, y'all, and that was the top of the Space Needle, the revolving floor, all that fun stuff. That was a lot of fun. I couldn't film up there a lot, though, because there was a lot of copyright music, but we did manage to drift into one catch six fighting type tasks. So let's just go straight in on it. Not shiny Hitmonchan. It's never gonna happen, guys. I'm gonna keep trying, but it's, it's not in my favor today. And I'm gonna click on a despawn Pokemon. Well, I was gonna show you guys everything, I had done in app today, but there's really not a whole lot to show you. Um, no hundos, no shinies. I haven't bothered with any legendaries or uh, megas because it's just, I don't know, there's no real point in it right now. I'd rather save my passes for like Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, and stuff that I actually care to try and get shiny. Uh, how about a male Nidoran? No, that would have been cool. So what we're going to do right now is the last entry for the nighttime of the Space Needle isn't until 8.15 and it's only 5.40, but you can go up there and get a table and have food and stuff. So I think what we're going to do is go up there, charge the phones, we'll hang out for a little bit and uh, see if we can lure up some stuff, maybe keep running the incense. I've still got three hours of incense to go, so hopefully something will happen. And then I'm going to show you guys the city at night because it's really pretty and the pictures I've seen are amazing. And also we've got a couple of raids popping in about 20, 30 minutes. So maybe we can get something out of that, but I'm gonna head back inside before MJ kills me. And we'll see you guys when it's time to watch the sunset and the city at light. All right, guys, we got a windy, shiny check going in. Let's go in on a shiny timber check. No, that would've gotten me in so much trouble anyway. 744 though, that's actually pretty good. So wifey got a spot inside. She's gonna go ahead and hold that for us while I do this. It's very windy out here, I'm sorry about that, but we're just waiting another, oh, two hours for the sun to go down, and then we're probably going to call it for the day, but the raids are coming slowly but surely, and is there anything? We have a timber. Oh, no, that was the one we just did. Okay, so in another minute, we've got another raid. We'll go ahead and see what that is and be right back. Guys, I knew it was going to happen. We came downstairs to get a water because you can't consume anything in the gift shop, and we were going to try to get a table. It didn't work out, but... uh. On the way down, wouldn't you know it, another shiny freaking Metatite. <laughs> 74 CP will just huck a golden raz at it, but like, that's number 14. You know, you know how to stop getting them? Listen, I was trying to click a Hitmonchan. I was drifting and I clicked and as I clicked, I drifted and hit a Metatite instead of a Hitmonchan. So there's my, there's my shiny Hitmonchan. Number 14 on a very crappy shiny Metatite, but we're just gonna hang out here. We've got a couple of three stars going up in like 20 to 30 minutes, so maybe something will come out of that and then we'll head upstairs. But right now it's just waiting out the sunset and hoping for something that's not a shiny Metatite. And ladies and gentlemen, that is Seattle at night from the top of the Space Needle. We had so much fun up there. I know once again, there wasn't a whole lot of Pokemon Go in this video. So to make up for that, I'm gonna do something that most people would probably consider kind of dumb, 
but we're gonna do it anyways to wrap up today's video because we didn't get anything else shiny. I really tried. We had a couple of timber raids. We had a Hitmonchan, a Hitmon lead, just nothing. And I ran out eight hours of incense and still could not get anything. But we have this pretty decent IV <laughs> level one Skrelp. And you know what? I'm just gonna go ahead and evolve it right now. We're gonna get a little Pokedex entry at the Space Needle because we're just waiting for our lift and then we're gonna go back and prep for everything tomorrow. So let's go ahead and get this done. And then there's one little update I need to go over before our lift driver does get here. Um, Dragoggle, if you know how to pronounce that, please let me know because I literally have no idea. But there it is in the Pokedex, 33 whopping CP. So the one little update we need to go over is kind of lame, but I'm gonna put up on screen right here. Niantic announced shiny or uh, shiny Smeargle in Pokemon Go. And the thing about it is that everybody's upset about, yeah, the event comes with a couple other things because of Pokemon Snap, but they're only going to be in snapshots with increased snapshots. And once the event goes away, so does Smeargle, just like Ditto, just like Unknown and everything else. And there's a lot of people mad about it because, you know, with the event, they're talking about Lotad, Cacnea, Ducklet, which only one of those can be shiny. And then in Raids, Vaporeon, Meganium, Trap Inch, only one of those can be shiny. And they're just recycling stuff that nobody needs. But I'm very excited about Pokemon Snap. I already have it pre-ordered. And Shiny Smeargle would be cool to, you know, get, but... The problem with that is they're putting it in something that's impossible to see it most of the time anyways. But let me know what you guys think about Shiny Smeargle down in the comments. I'm not going to make a whole video on it because it would just be complaining. And there's no point in that because I don't believe in it. Because like I said, with Ditto, with Smeargle, with Unknown, with all of it, they're doing the same crap. But our lift is going to be here in just a few minutes. So I'm going to get out of here to get ready for tomorrow. If you guys did enjoy today's adventure, please make sure to smash that like button for me. Hit the subscribe button and click on the notification bell when you do. Also, don't forget to go check out the Twitch channel because we're getting into that a lot more. And if that's not enough for you, make sure to check out the links to my merch and Patreon down in the description. And let me know down in the comments, have you gotten a good rival shiny? And we will catch you guys in the next one.